Hey everyone, it's been a while since I played Starfield, so I'm uh, just going to give you a bit of a, I don't know, refresher, I guess. Um, I was on MO2 with Starfield. I moved to collections on Vortex to have a bit of an easier time um, uploading my mod list. And I'm probably going to do a Scar Skyrim again. I mean, MO2 is okay, but it's easier to share my collections with you guys on Vortex. So I think uh, I'll post this today when I when I do the video and then you guys can try it there. It doesn't work very well with Vortex right now because it's still in the early stages of getting it to... I had to like reinstall all my mods after I installed them. And uh, I, it was a bit of a, a B word to get it working right, but uh, I did get it working. But hopefully it works well for you if that's what you're interested in. So I had to make a new character because my mod list got changed, obviously. So my level 30 whatever is toast. But I got a lot of mods working. I actually got Carrigen working properly, so my character looks better. I think, anyway. But So I had to make a new game. This is right after the intro. I actually got this mod to skip the intro, which is really nice. Because it's so long. Yes, sir. You there. You are new probationary then? Crew Chief Herat, pleasure to be working with you. It's my job to make sure all you rocket jockeys are ready for anything that comes at you up there. Now, Manifest says we're fitting you out with one comms repair suite. In addition to the standard issue welcome kit all probationary pilots get for their first mission. Med packs, some small arms, couple spare ship parts, all the essentials in case of any surprises up there. My people will have everything on your ship before you lift off. Won't even know they were there. Hmm. So we're doing the UC Vanguard, I think. Scenic Tau City Two. Nice easy one for your first job. Just keep your head on swivel, and you'll come home safe. Any questions before you head out? Then I won't keep you. Make us look good out there, recruit. Conversation isn't terribly great in this game, so I usually don't want people to yak any longer than they need to so I can't afford the uh the buggy yet or the doom buggy whatever it is like the the vehicle I don't know if I can sell some stuff to them maybe but I'm very fresh it's a very fresh character like I literally just finished the mission at the the lodge and then I got sent here uh let's see if we can sell Sell from inventory. Oh, this is my um. I can have that. I'm sure I'll find more, oh, more of this. Sell. Thirteen thousand. Oh, maybe I can sell something better. Did you pick? Here, have a cube. I have cellulite. No, there's no way I'm going to get enough money. Okay, let's just, uh, we'll come back and get the buggy later. Pretty expensive for, like, a new character. And he's our new captain. Okay, no problem. 25,000, yeah, I don't, uh... We'll come back later. Probably like right after this mission. I know like once you start looting and running around and stuff like that. You uh get money really fast. What on earth is going on? What is up with my ship right now? Okay, well, let's just go in. One of the main reasons I like to play this game is because it gives me, like, Firefly vibes. You know, I get a little bit of my space fantasy. Oh, all my systems were turned off. That was weird.
Whenever I see Tau, like the Tau cluster, I always think of like Artemis Tau. Very empty ship right now. An abandoned meat pack. Sarah, chill. She's like vibrating. I wonder what happened here. Uh, well, there's no waifus here, so they something bad happened. Yeah, I don't have my jetpack yet either. Like, I've got, uh... Oh. Do I don't have a pack? Oh, this one's a basic boost pack. See you later, mining pack. Garbage. Yeah, there we go. That's better. I mean, it doesn't really help too much, but I'm just so used to, like... Jetpack boosting everywhere, and I don't need to. Um, there's blood everywhere. Something's been through here recently, but left everything in place. Huh, at least we know it wasn't the Crimson Fleet. I need to get Andredger mommy soon. She's my favorite. I don't know if you guys like her more than Sarah. Maybe that'll sell for a lot. I I definitely do. Uh, Sarah is. She's not poorly made as a character. I just, she's terribly annoying and very naggy. What have we here? I pretty much just grab everything in the beginning of the game because just to get money. Like I said earlier, like you're, you're, you're really broke for like the first three hours. And my HUD is being weird. I'm, I wonder if I can turn that off. It was possibility. Dialogue camera, vanity camera. Or was it interface? Show item information and HUD on. Is that it? Oh. I don't know if that did it, but Red Stick is mine. You know, like, I'll give it to them. The game does look good, except for the characters. Like, they made a good looking game. It, is it terribly fun, though? Not really. Like, you can't. It's fun to play for a little bit. But the longer you play, the, wor the worse it gets, you know? Oh, no, it didn't go away. See, it's like my HUD's messed up. I, I can't get that to. I think I have too many HUD mods on right now. So until I can fix that, I don't know if I should give you guys the mod list. I'll try and fix that and then before I upload it. Okay, so we're going down there. Probably faster just to... Uh... What heck was that? Someone crashed. That's bright. Oh, you don't look so good. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that. It's not supposed to. It's just supposed to be off. I don't know if that'll help, but no. There must be some HUD mod that I have too many of them at a time. Ooh, free loot. Haha, <laughs> pill bottles. Somebody's been living off painkillers. Frankenstein sells for $700? Really? Damn. What do we got here? They're too clean to be one of the settlers. Or a pirate. You see on patrol, maybe? 
You'll make my day if you said you were a shock trooper out for a stroll. Vanguard, huh? Yeah, I expect they didn't. I'm Hadrian. I'm a... I was a researcher with the UC. I, I came here on a rumor of a... Well, I expect you saw the results on your way in. What's left of the settlers? The work of Oxisio Machina. A terramorph. One of the nastiest aliens humanity's ever crossed paths with. And this one, well, it's something of an anomaly. Possibly a worrying one. I can't believe that a terramorph did all this damage. I mean, I've heard the stories, but to see the decimation firsthand. <laughs> I sure could. Because to confirm my suspicions about this creature, I'm gonna need a tissue sample from it. And to get that, I need its corpse. <sighs> but there is a way we can give ourselves an edge against this thing. The plant's security system. The admin terminal's here in this building, but it needs its connection reset. And as I found out, that's not a one-person job. But if you can make it to the security outpost and restore the connection, I think I can get things back online. See if the settlers left us any other tools. Good. Once I see the connection reset, I'll get things underway on my end. Take care of yourself out there. And make sure you leave enough of that thing for us to get a sample. Bye-bye, Hadrian. It's actually uh, one year today that Starfield's been out. It's kind of crazy, you know? Thinking how fast time goes by. And I guess the expansion's out this... September? September something. It's kind of why I wanted to get leveled up. I do want to get it. Um, oh, boy. Those don't sell for a lot, but you can pick up a whole bunch and then use them for crafting. And that HUD thing is starting to bug me. I'm like a perfectionist when it comes to HUD. When something's not working, it just like slowly eats away at me. Is that a vial? No. Oh. I like the basic HUD and UI is just so bad I don't I can't use it. Has to be clean. System offline. Oh, over there. Ooh, that's bright. They need a dark mode for computers. Connection restored. I'll make this quick. Hmm. Plants turrets took a beating. But I should be able to get you a couple of kill lanes. Just get the thing to chase you down the alleys between the buildings, and you'll lead it right into a crossfire. Oh, hello? I wish I'd found this earlier. You notice those sensors around the facility? Part of a livestock tracking system. So the mod kit's been out for, what, two months now? And I thought there would have been a uh, body replacer yet, so far, like CBBE. But they must be having problems with it. Let's take that. Sell it. Hi, Gourmet. On. Is that it? Oh, one, eight, three, five. Okay. Trackers reading green. What's that sound? Security lockdown is active. Shit. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing and get in cover. It's on the move. Kicks it away. Avoid direct engagement. The kill lights. They're set up but need power. There's breakers on each of the buildings you can throw to get them alive. Once they're online, lead the terror towards the lights and watch the fireworks. 
Oh, what's with the music? It just like went crazy. Run, run, run. Hey, what's with this music right now? <laughs> it's just out of nowhere. It's loud. Turn this thing on. Sarah. Wait, can I do this one? Stand clear. Two out of three. The other one's up there. Good, sir. me or does this gun suck? Wow, they are like meat shields. Let's try 180? 142. Todd, chill with the music, please. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I never searched down here. Trekker's gone quiet. I suspect it's either hiding or... Wait. You did it, didn't you? <laughs> Essence above, you just flatlined a terror morph. I'm not too proud. Thank you for saving my ass. <laughs> you didn't happen to grab me a tissue sample, did you? All right. I spotted a microscope downstairs. Let's see if we can't get to the bottom of this. Oh, you have to wait for her to like <laughs> meander down very slowly. Ooh, what's this? It's a purple rattler? I'm gonna take that piece of crap. That, that, that. So I got this mod to actually get rid of a lot of junk on the desk. 
like junk that you cannot click is gone. It's like, why would you put something there that we can't actually use? Like a waste of space, you know, and video memory. I'm going to consume that and that half eaten sandwich. It's probably hers. Uh, duct tape. can do. Running basic diagnostics? Nothing. Flag scan? Spectrum. Oh, we got some... Lock is too... No. Oh. This equipment? It's not set up to do a proper analysis of our sample. This terramorph being here, of all places, it doesn't make sense. Humanity's spread plenty of creatures in our travels across the stars. Pets, livestock, pests. But terramorphs? They're different. To our knowledge, no one's ever spread them intentionally. Yet somehow, they follow us. So when humans settle a world, 70 to 100 years later, Terramorphs tend to just appear. No one knows how or why. Dangerous, but at least predictable. Talcetti, though, it's too young to have a native population. It's only been colonized 20 years. But then the other option, that someone captured one of the deadliest predators in the galaxy just to wipe out some settlers minding their own business? That seems awfully implausible. Which means we're either looking at a truly strange murder or a faster type of terramorph growth, the results of which could be catastrophic. Terramorph outbreaks have taken down far bigger colonies than this one. Sounds like we need to do something quick, Hadrian. You're right. We just need more information first. Time was, I had access to one of the best repositories of Terramorph research in the galaxy. Seems a natural place to start looking, if I can figure how to access it. But we also need to get this sample properly analyzed, get confirmation on just how concerned we should be. Luckily, I think I know just the person to help with the sample. What would you say to delivering this to him for me? Yeah, I'd do it myself, but I need to call in some favors. See if I can't get access to that Terramorph data. <sighs> Plus, maybe just pop by a hospital for a little bit. Clear it with your commander first if you have to. You can even show them this. My gene tag. Tell them Hadrian Sanan is worried there could be more attacks on the horizon. They should recognize the name. That's all I'm asking. I need Dr. Percival Walker to put together a sample analysis for this thing. Full workup. He'll know what that means. I'm not sure exactly where to find him, but last I heard he was contracting with the Trade Authority on Mars. There's a place called the Sixth Circle in Sidonia. A bar run by some old friends. I'll meet you and Percival there. And here. It's not a lot, but... You've definitely earned it. Should cover the cost of fuel to Mars, at least. Now, please, go check in with your commander. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Thank you. Jeez. Like, you could have just said in one one sentence, like, take this to Mars and to find out what it is, and that's it. And a lot of, uh... Talk, talk, talk. Okay, so... Grunt work. Markers online. All right. Um, what about main story? Let's just go here first. We can do the UC stuff later. I don't want to do that right now.
useful spot in this rather drab city. Scrap drive. Suppose that would explain the brownout. So what's this going to run? The miners pretty Sorry. much run the road. What do you mean there's no one? Look at this place. I can't imagine being cramped down here, choking in the fumes. Oh wait, isn't uh, isn't it like right around the corner? It's depressing. Yeah. Can't believe we're still pulling up huge. Keep it simple or keep to yourself. You ain't been around. One off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. Oh, believe me, I've heard it. After about round three or four, it was all he would talk about. And he's got a voice that carries. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But... <clears throat> he has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but... If I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? Is that? Oh, that's it. Twenty five hundred dollars. I'm gonna try and persuade you. Come on. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. You're gonna guilt trip me. Plus two. Guess I should ask you the same. Oh wow, he doesn't. Uh... I want him found. I do. All right, I give up. Just trying to earn a living here. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the lady of love. <laughs> Singing songs. All that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Oh, fine. We'll make do. Don't forget it. Let's get out of here. Maybe it's not too late to catch a ride back home. Oh, well, that was easy. I uh, thought that he was going to give me the runaround and we would be talking to a million different people. So, uh, whoa, I don't want my ship. Oh, wait, maybe I can sell stuff right now. Sell stuff and see if I have enough for that uh, stupid rover. Be advised to secure yeah, the lots of stuff. and Just find ask. stable ground. Yo, hey, what's up? You looking to do some shopping here at the Trade Authority? I'm Minaki. Feel free to ask me anything and I'll do my... You say you're Minaki, but I'm going to call you Jonah. Cool. Uh, did something just, like, explode? Explode. Okay, so let's sell that. That... No, I found a book, didn't I? Okay, so Kraken takes 655. Five. So does the Maelstrom. Goodbye, Maelstrom. Not enough money yet. Come back anytime. This place just like rattled. It is now safe to resume normal activity. So we're on our way to Venus. Of their control. 
Or so they say. No, but I think I see something else that might. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it, we could download its logs and figure out where our vanguard was heading to next. Exactly. Minimal ship power. Go slow. We grab the data on that satellite and jump away. So minimize ship power to avoid detection. Turn off weapons and shields. Let's just uh, put those all the way up. Oh, great serpent. Bless this communion that we may walk in Janan Verun's footsteps. That he jumped from the soul system out into the beyond and touched your magnificence. That he learned the truth of the shrouding, the coming eternal embrace. That you will reward the promised and cast the accursed into shadow. This is back on Moira. To all you see affiliated ships, I'm heading to the Nova Galactic Storyard orbiting from Smoke. Yeah, yeah, I know. The whole place is decommissioned. But I need parts for emergency repairs. Hopefully it hasn't been picked clean yet. Oh, that's not good. Earth and everything around it was abandoned a long time ago. And the old star yards are crawling with spacers and other scavengers. Off to the moon. Stations can be docked with allowing you to board them. Okay. Well, let's may as well turn these back up. Okay, as I was like free spinning. Ooh, that's not good. Two steps in, and we're already looking at a corpse. Okay, it's not Vanguard Moara. Looks like spacers were scavenging around here, and someone else came in and said hello. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with a spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot. And fleet. Just countless desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive. Thanks for the history lesson, but I already knew that. Wait, where am I wearing my spacesuit here? I think that mod for auto hide is not working during hers. Ooh, the kitchen. Nice. 
loaf of bread. Hey! Just looking for lunch, guys. Oh, you got him, didn't you? Uh, Grendel. Well, the other guy just, like, took off, I guess. time I guess getting a lot of purples Is that normal that guy <laughs> food snacks coffee wait here's a latte must be a latte machine around here secret outpost Loyal to your crew, I get it. There's a secret Elspeth's outpost you're trying to crack? Okay. Oh, it's the Mantis one. Do I have a... Oh, no, not, not yet. <laughs> Rip. Oh wait, can I get in there through here? Will the computer unlock it? Probably not. I guess we'll just have to come back when I uh, have better skills. Shotgun. Good. Meal tray. Trying to get some better stuff. Before it was all just like junk. Infirmary. Oh, 
I am encumbered, apparently. I remember until you actually put points. Oh wait, why is my mouse so low? I, I um, edited uh, settings. Couldn't be like that, that I'm aware of. Hold on. Gameplay? Oh, what? why did it revert? That's weird. My settings didn't save from last time. Yeah, there we go, 1100 mass. I'm okay with losing the experience in order to get the stuff. Oh, sir. Hold on. Okay, there we go. I had to uh, turn off the one accessibility setting. Apparently it's still busted and the guy who did um, Star HUD Still has not updated it, so I think it's an abandoned project. So, whoever worked on Sky UI, if you can uh, make mods for this game, I'd be very happy. Me and many, many, many other people. Right, so I think I went the wrong way. I took the wrong turn. Yes, I did. It's over here. Somebody wants to fight. Or so I thought. <laughs> What's this place? kind of classroom. Oh, wait, we were here before. I remember that. It's too bad you can't just drink water from the cooler. It'll be so much easier. So they sort of added survival mode in a way, but... Not quite. That's it for this gun. A stupid combat knife. Oh, 
Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, well, um, I died there and my game crashed. Typical Bethesda. They're like, no, you are not allowed to die. Not today. Alright, so where were we? We lost about five minutes of gameplay, I think. Um, I got rid of my star hut, though. It's just having too many problems. You know, it's just, like, not working right, and... I'd rather just... Like, I, I know I said I don't like the vanilla UI, but I would rather have that than a, a UI mod that's not working properly. Oh my god, Sarah. There. I forgot in this game it's set to V. I'm like, I'm trying to hit Sarah and something's not working. It was really weird as my FPS went off when I turned off Star HUD. I mean, I still have Star UI. Absolutely, I need that. Like, I can't play without it. So it still looks decent here, but my HUD is vanilla. I'm okay with the inventory... I mean, I'm okay with the, the vanilla HUD HUD, like this. But like the, in, the inventory UI, it has to be modded. It's just really bad. Like, what I said earlier, I meant to say like their HUD's not terrible, but their inventory is awful. It's not the greatest either. All right, so we want Coachman. Because I ran out of ammo. And I think I have slow healing set up on my gameplay, and I actually don't want that. Oh wait, no, I didn't want that. I wanted um food healing. Wait, no, normal. Oh, positive. This is what I wanted. Positive only for food healing. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's better. You know, I kind of wish that they had character stats in this game, too. Like strength, intelligence, you know, stuff like that. See, that doesn't look great, but it's clean. Whereas Star, U Star HUD is broken. Because I like the colors. Having it color graded. But, you know, we'll, we'll live with it. We still need to find any song. Bye for now. Bye, Sarah. You never. These guys all sound like Batman, don't they? I got you, sir. What have we got? What's with all the cubes? They're everywhere. That was a flattering way to die. I'm behind glass, dumbasses. Can't shoot me. Manual. 
Very nice. Point blank. Boom. Ooh. Someone over there hits hard. You know what I might do instead of hard? Let's do normal and then player combat damage hard. So I hit for less damage. Try that. Because he actually hits pretty hard. And look at all the food you have to pound down just to heal. Uh, while wounded, yes. Oh wait, and I wanted to equip uh, grenades. Have that. Oh no, it's the bolt sponge boss. There has a buckshot right in your forehead. Good job, sir. I think that might be all of them. Oh, never mind. I think that's all of them. We did it. Hey, I think I got some outfits too. This is from KZ, if you're wondering. Just like the reprobate tattoos. What's weird is usually here it lagged out too when I had Star HUD. Or if that was like the source of a lot of my problems. Sorry if I had to reclaim some UC property, but this whole Star Yard is overrun. I've patched up my ship and I'm heading to Neptune. Going to put in another request to get the fleet out here to deal with these spacers. But until then, if any of you thugs are listening, I'm the damn ghost stealing your stuff in the night. Clear out while you have the chance. Hmm. It's almost daring the space is to come. Now they want us to go to Neptune. <laughs> How very Bethesda. Much better odds destroying one of their ships than fighting them all at once here. Yeah, I'm so used to Tab being uh zoom out in third person. Because I've been playing um other games.
Yeah, so that's pretty much the mission for this place. And now they want you to go to Neptune, I think. I don't remember if they ended up sending you everywhere. Sorry, I'm just like plugging my mouse and going crazy. Do you guys play wireless or do you play with wired mouse? I like, ever since doing wireless mice, I can't go back to wired. Sometimes I like, have to charge it. But, like like keyboards, I, it's doesn't matter if it's plugged in or not. You know, because it never moves. All right, I think I have some enemies to loot here. I know we killed that guy. That bullet sponge enemy. And I think he's on the upper level. Did we just loot this place or not? Oh, no, we didn't. Okay, yeah, let's go upstairs. Get the story moving so I can get on treasure. Okay, so what does this guy have? Take a look. Okay, so he's got a rattler. Got a grendel. Okay, why does it ask you that? Like, it should just automatically take all of them? Armored space helmet. I think he was the trouble child, but I don't 100% remember. I thought he was down here somewhere. I remember a big firefight that we had with someone. You're getting credits more and more now. And when you actually do take a break from this game, it doesn't feel so bad playing for a little bit. It's just like when you've been playing all day and you keep playing and keep playing, it uh, doesn't feel great after a while. Come on, Sarah. Without mods, though, absolutely not. There's, there's no way. Okay, this is the... Uh, stem out a bit. Don't need that. Yeah, he died like up here. Like right here. Yeah, so that was him. Okay. Give us a new helmet. Well, let's check it out. The packs. I got the lead line. So it's a basic boost pack. That's what I wanted. Ooh, ecliptic. And helmet. There we go. It's auto. Oh, good. Auto hide's working now. Let's take that. Like, I don't like that little line with the circle there pointing to it because I, I I know the chair that I'm pointing my middle screen my my little white dot at it's you know it's not necessary oh, Bethesda but like I said I'm pretty sure the Skyrim Sky UI will come to Starfield soon with the mod kit being out do it in Equinox I actually like lasers but I don't like using them like, I like how the sound and feel in this game, but they're really, really weak, even with perks. Maybe we'll get like a order, like, what's that perk mod I used to Skyrim Ordinator? I think so. That's pretty much it. I think we were here, or yeah, I remember this, we were, that was a closed door there. Go this way. Yeah, this is all familiar. If you're interested in that leotard I'm using, it's Andreja's um, leotard outfit, but you can get it so it's a standalone as well, so you can actually loot it. And they give it to you in a random container, I think is where I found it. Some, like, loot box. If, if you're interested, yeah. 
Yeah, the game looks good. Like, it's with mods, of course, with mods. Even without it, still looks good, but looks so much better. I just wish that Bethesda could nail their character textures down and make their characters good, look good and not so goofy. Okay, so next we're going to Neptune. Cannot travel while my... Oh. Yeah, ever since I got rid of the HUD mod, like, it's... There's no interface like now. Before, it would, like... This would leg out quite a bit. Let's actually spend... I need a uh, lock picking level 2. Where is that? Security? Oh, I haven't locked in... I haven't opened enough stuff yet. Heavy weapons. Uh, this is what I need. It's locked. Uh, sure. I vendor crap a lot. Zoom, zoom. Isn't that beautiful? Wait, you see that? There's a ship just drifting. I'm sorry, I'm not simping for Starfield right now. That could be our vanguard. Something's wrong. The ship's weapons are powering up. Get ready. Shooting at us, we'd be more than happy to respond. It's not me. Works hijacked my ship. Why find a couple of them, but they hunt me down. Really could use an assist. We blow that ship out of the stars, he's dead, and our artifact's gone. We're going to have to board. Target the engines. Once they stall out, we'll have our chance. Like clipping into the ship here. Let's uh, stow my crafting stuff. Wait. Okay, I am um, accidentally took. The ship parts. Just put that all the way. Where's those ship repair? I'm pretty sure I just stole those. <laughs> Took those? Yeah. Let's store all. There we go. Pizza. Wow. This person drank a lot of coffee. We gotta go upstairs. Uh, no, apparently not. Oh my god, they look so much cooler, these little ecliptics. They're like the lame spacesuits they had on before.
a little help, yeah? But first, I need to take your chewy pies. I got to meet whoever you two are. Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too, about a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Hey, I'll trade some weird space rock for a rescue anytime. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. <laughs> it is a hood ornament. Okay. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. Uh, right, back to the lodge and see what happens. Probably nothing. I'm going to take your tape measure. So what have we got, coachman? Apparently I need to work on my... Oh, wait. We need to... Let's track the Kiro Sands. Is that what it says? Kerosene's? Okay, compensator. Tactical, so we need grip and stock mods one. Standard shells. Critical. You are now hydrated. Well, that's good. You know, I kind of miss the Fallout 4 style camera when you switch views. Like, you know, it would just like move in a little bit. Uh oh, time to see. Bye bye, Sarah. Did you? <laughs> it fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added. Then it harmonizes, like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here, you've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. Well, if you ever find a relic bottle from Earth, we'll all be happy to share it with you. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You <coughs> got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. First, there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it, no other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Level up. I hope you are satisfied with the quarter. So I think in my next Starfield video we'll do is we'll go recruit Andresha and do some more stuff there. We've always considered ourselves explorers, but this really is uncharted territory. Ah! Oh, I gotta go see a doctor. I think there is one oh look at that. So my 
All right, dude, they updated the maps. Wait, was there always a Reliant Medical that close? Or is it just me? I don't remember it being this close ever. Oh man, it's so nice to have that stuff on your HUD. And to have a surface map. Like this should have been here at launch or they should have, they should have put off the, the release date. Can you imagine if they released this game with the maps like this and the rovers? I bet you they would have gotten a better public reception. Okay, so we got to go in here. Should you find yourself in need, medical supplies are available for purchase at, if I may say, welcome to a Reliant. All right, what can I do for you? Oh my, it's a good thing you came in to see me. Take care of it all. Some good old fashioned stitching and you'll be set. We'll get you feeling better in no time. There you are, right is rain. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. Sell some stuff, eh? Yeah, he doesn't want anything I have. May you remain in good health. Well, guys, that's it for today. It's actually been in over an hour. Uh, had a lot of fun, though. I didn't think I was going to. I thought I was going to have a miserable time playing tonight. But, uh, yeah, actually, a bit of time away helped a lot. And got a new sort of mod list going on. So I'm hoping for more outfits from KZ. He's doing an awesome job. I'm hoping for a Skyrim HUD. Like, I mean, a Sky, a Sky UI type HUD. Uh, Star UI inventory works fine, but the HUD is busted. And it's been busted for a while. There's been no updates. The mod's pretty much dead. Uh, I would love... The in-game guns are fine to me, honestly. Like, they look good. They feel good. I don't really need COD guns, but I'll still use them. I'll still download them and mod them. Uh, looking forward to a lot of outfits, maybe CBBE, more hairstyles, kind of the stuff I like in Fallout 4. And maybe just populating planets and adding a lot of enemies to the game in a lot of locations would be a really good step up to get this game some positive feedback and uh, new eyes on it, you know? But uh, features looking good, I think, for Starfield, and that's good because it looked pretty bleak there last year. But uh, yeah, um, next time we will do the Saul stuff, get Rindrasha, probably continue UC. Hope to see you guys there.